What's up guys and welcome back for another video with your boy Sharky Belk in the realm of Tibia. So today guys I thought I was going to show you how to obtain the Crusader helmet. It's a little easy quest located just a little bit north of Fias at a place called Mount Sternum. So what, you wanna go, wanna, what you're going to want to do is make your way north to this place and then follow this guide that I'm basically going to show you the guide, the step by step on how to get there, how to get through the quest. <sighs> the helmet itself isn't particularly worth too much money, but on the market you can, you'll still be able to fetch 6k for it roughly anyway, which could be helpful to you. Make sure to bring a rope and shovel with you this time though because you're going to be going down some holes and then back up those holes afterwards to get out. You're also going to need yourself a any melee weapon will do, but I've brought myself a little knife because it's light and easy to carry with no big uh, constraints on uh, capacity used. You're going to be fighting a couple of guards, dwarf guards and um, dwarf soldiers as well on the way, so if you bring yourself some avalanches or some sort of runes to contend with those, that's a big help to you as well. Bearing in mind though, at the end is the big nasty, the giant spider, who <laughs> is a little bit more difficult to contend with than the dwarves. See, I'm just running right past these, they're not even a big deal. The, the giant spiders, however, though, you, you're probably going to want to have to kill. There's four of them in total down in the quest. Oh, gone the wrong way. In the uh, in the quest zone, but only three of them. If if you're lucky, will you actually only have to fight? These dwarf guards don't hit particularly much either, as you can see. I'm just running right past them, and they're not even damaging me really in the slightest. So it's fine. Down the next hole you go, and then north up here. I'm gonna just kill this one and get rid of him. Bearing in mind though, to do this quest you have to be level 35 because there is a gate of expertise right here for you to pass through. Mysterious gate, level 35. Anyway, down the hole you go and here we go. This is the quest area where everything is gonna either go to plan uh, smoothly or it's gonna go horribly, horribly wrong. Supplies and stuff that you would need. If you've already killed a giant spider before, you're gonna, you know what you're gonna have to do. It's just basically the same thing. Right. The cobwebs here, you want to use your melee weapon on it to break open the cobweb, the spider web. If you stand here, only one giant spider will be able to get you as well. So you're gonna be completely safe. And you can just tank, phase tank it to start with and then run them later on after this first one, this initial giant spider is dead much easier then you want to get and then what you're gonna wanna you're going to want to head left to the west side of the cave that is where the um, crusader helmet is located in a skeleton's body you don't need to worry about anything down here do not go down this hole because it leads to lost bashes which will probably at your level lead to an instant death so that's no good and the other giant spider is just down there And there's the Crusader helmet right there. Let's finish up this uh, giant spider. And then we can just sit and admire our loot. Anyway, so none of the giant spiders dropped us anything. But here is our <laughs> Crusader helmet. Weighs 52 ounces, so make sure you have the capacity in your backpack before you do this quest. Guys, that is the end of this video. If you liked this and didn't know about this quest and found it helpful and informative, please go ahead and hit that like button and maybe even subscribe to me too for more videos on the regular. I'll be back with another one, guys, real soon. So take care. Bye-bye.